Good to see you in the flesh, boss. You as well, my acolyte. These Dunraven chambers are a wonder, even if they are a tool of the enemy. With you gone, I've been running the Enlightened. Figured it's what you would have wanted. But I gotta tell you, things are pretty bleak right now. World's going to hell, and not just on account of Nemesis. I've heard. Things aren't much better in the bubble. I'm finding my position with the researchers increasingly tenuous. Our counterparts from Nemesis Node have extended something of an olive branch. I don't get it. Isn't that good? On paper, yes. It means their hostilities have ceased. But it's pretty clear to me that what they want is nothing less than the eradication of all exogenous influence on our world. Uh-huh. Mm. Fate worse than death for you, me, and the Enlightened. Precisely. The other researchers have me outvoted 12 to 1 in favor of these Nemesis peace talks. Can't you just use your voodoo to get into Avenir's head? I thought you said you were connected to all other Jarvises through the Ultimate. Everyone but him. How is that possible? If I had to guess, I'd say it's that gauche helmet of his. I think they're just trying to block exogenous influence, and by extension, it blocks me. But the communal Jarvis consciousness is not without its uses. It's made me realize that the Helios artifact is the key to our plans. How so? On at least one other world, it was used as a beacon for the Nazir. And that's good why? Because I do not believe the artifact to be exogenous specific. You think if we flip a switch on it, we can use it as a lure for the Shapers? Our friends. Got it in one. But there is a bit of good news that could come from the de-escalation of the Nemesis conflict. They control the barriers keeping me trapped here. A detente with Nemesis suggests to me that my return home is imminent. So we don't gotta use these chambers as phone booths no more? Yes, Gabby. And that being the case, I want you to do something for me. Ultimately, I fear the Dunraven chambers are the tools of Ada. I want you to destroy them for me. Each and every one of them. How do we do that? Dr. Bogdanovich planted a chip in one of the chambers that was meant to shut them all down. But I gather Ada dispatched Devra before she could activate it. I need you to find the chip and finish what Devra started. I've been giving Wendy a wide berth since we learned Ada can backseat drive her brain. But you never know when that AI is listening. Eyes in the back of my head, boss. You taught me that. You keep your head on a swivel, too. Whenever it happens, it'll be good to have you back. <laughs>